having production know you, a little bit about your personality, having that advantage I think is really important. I believe is really important because people want to work with people that they trust and that they're excited to have on set. But how do you have production know who you are before auditioning for them? Like how do you even meet these people? Industry events. So let's go to some mixers together. Let's go to this Aura casting event. I've talked about Aura before. It's an online casting company, 100% online. If you're an actor in the US, go ahead and submit yourself. You just put your photos, your information. If you do have a rep, they will send their information to them when they have casting calls. If not, they'll send them directly to you. You can do a self tape and then you can get booked. As far as I know, mostly in um, California, although I have seen some stuff in Colorado for them. Let's go to this Aura casting event. People are starting to get here because it's like just past seven. Um, <laughs> there's a bunch of vendors here. So um, I am doing a raffle. I'm doing two 53 inch paper backdrops, just like this one. You all have to do is subscribe to my channel and then I'm going to be giving away two later today. And then um, there's gonna be a bunch of entertainment. Content creator, and today I'm here thanks to Taylor. Um, and I'm just showing you guys who I am. I'm an actor, and I like to share about myself on YouTube, yeah. um, how to do self tape auditions, and also just my experience as an actor. So my self tape audition setup is over there today. If you miss me already, you pay attention now because now is the time. And sure, yeah. And I feel like not enough people saw it yet, so. I'm going to contact Savage Universal, which is who provided the backdrops, and ask them for one more. So if you haven't um, entered, come back after, and I'm going to have you guys enter, the rest of you. But the person that's going to win the 53-inch uh, in super white is... I emailed Savage. I haven't heard back. So I'm pretty sure they're going to say yes. But if they say no, guess who's going to use her credit card? So let's choose a winner for the third paper backdrop. Look at all the people that entered. Whoa. Okay. I did take out already the two people that won at the event, but I'm doing a third one because I wanted to. Oh, this one's blank. <gasps> no way. Lorena Flores. Um, she is a subscriber. So maybe you are watching this, Lorena. Um, she told me her last name was Flores. And I was like, wait, you know, my last name is Flores too. So I was like, we're cousins. So my cousin won this. We're not actual cousins. Lorena, DM me. Um, give me. Actually, I'll DM you because I just started following you on Instagram too. You won. I'm going to send you this video and you better watch this. I'm not going to tell you you won. I'm just going to send you this video, and once you watch it, you're going to know you won. But you on a 53-inch paper backdrop, so what you're going to do is you're going to send me your email, and then I'm going to put you in touch with Savage, and you can choose whatever 53-inch paper backdrop you want, whatever color, or I'm just going to use my credit card, and I'll send it to you via Amazon. Maybe it's not the case, but is it because... Like, do they have these vendors in part to warm people up? You know, if you're coming by yourself and you don't really know who to talk to, somebody easy to approach is somebody who's selling things. Warm up conversations with the vendors first, and then you can continue and talk to more people. And you can be like, hey, did you visit the candle place? They had some pretty cool names on their candles. Conversation starters. Is that why there's vendors? Networking wise for me, I met so many actors. A lot of people actually came up to my booth, like my self tape setup thinking it was for photos. And they were asking me like, oh, can I take a photo here? You know, of course they could, but I would also tell them like, oh, this is actually my self tape audition setup. I'm an actor. And I would ask them what they use for their backdrops. A few of them said the wall or that they used a pop-up one, or I showed them how a full body shot would look like with a seamless paper because it's nice and clean. You don't see the edges of the pop-up backdrop or anything. I want to say I met around 30 actors. I only filmed a portion of the people that I actually met, I said hello to an owner of a production company that I've worked with before. He's also a director, the DP for that production company. I met another owner, two more owners of production companies, one in Sacramento and one in the Bay Area. I met a few agents. Um, one of them was Dina from 
Sacramento who also reps people in the Bay Area. 350 people, it really felt like so many more, but because there were vendors and circus performers, there was a DJ, really good music, photo booths, like there were so many things where everybody was like walking around. So it's not like you stayed in the same circle, at least I didn't see that. You really got to move around and talk to people and people were introducing people. And throughout the event, um, people would just ask me like, hey, do you know this or that? Or when I said hello to my friend who owns a production company I was like do you want to meet some actors or like sure so I like grabbed my friend Justin and I was like Justin meet Max and you know just like I, I, I just the energy was really good and I think it's all because of Taylor and Emily um, they have such a friendly open energy sometimes casting directors can get very overwhelmed and overworked or agents um, but I think Taylor and Emily do a really good job of keeping a positive light energy and this event I believe was definitely a success if you were at the event please leave me a comment tell me that you're here because I was so excited to meet some people that actually watch my videos thank you so much to Aura please go check them out on Instagram and you can submit yourself um, on their website and thank you so much to Savage Universal for gifting these paper backdrops again not sponsored at all there's a lot more mixers in december that i'm going to go to la and san francisco bay area so let me know if you know of any that i should go to that you enjoy tell me what your questions are around mixers i'm not an expert but i can tell you my experience as somebody who actually enjoys going to these things i went to another huge mixer in arizona this summer it's this one right here with casting director bella hibbs highly recommend checking her out too she gives out a lot of really helpful information.